concern. That's something the students at the Temple ISD Regional Day School for the Deaf are learning about. They wanted to make sure their superintendent felt like a part of their deaf community. Fox 44's Mally Jones shows us how this all came about. Thornton Elementary is the home to deaf and hard of hearing students all around the area. And superintendent Dr. Bobby Ott has made it a point to become part of that community. That is the sign name the deaf education students came up with for their superintendent, Dr. Bobby Ott. Bethany, which is one of the students, is the one that came up with this, has my sign name, and this is O, and then next to my glasses because I wear glasses. But not just anyone can give or receive a sign name. If you are often in the deaf community and, you know, are a part of like our little family here, then often um, you have a sign name so that we can refer to you like we do everyone else. Sign names are a part of deaf culture and can only be given by a deaf person. Dr. Ott wanted a sign name and the students wanted to give that to him. He made them feel like they were included like any other classroom he would visit in Temple. When coming up with the sign name, the deaf person looks at different characteristics or unique things about the person. Sometimes it's based off of your um, like interests and hobbies like if you are really good at basketball or like if you love pizza stuff like that sometimes that's how it's made. The deaf education teachers and interpreters help ensure equal access to education. Perfect. Deaf ed teacher Katie Swan emphasized that her kids are just like everyone else. They want to have fun, they want to have friends, they want to be able to talk about Santa and what they want for Christmas. And she encourages everyone to learn a little bit of sign language. <laughs> Learning sign and even just saying hello just lights up their world. It's not something to be scared of or to avoid. Dr. Ott says it's important to be a part of all the different programs in all the different schools. In Temple, Mally Jones, Fox 44 News.